UFC number 11th rank light heavyweight contender Paul Craig has been out of the octagon since his last win against the Mahal Hill. He won that fight via submission and he dislocated Jamahal Hill arm. Paul Craig is currently on a four fight winning streak and he has some very good name on his resume. He has a victory over Magomed Ankalaev, who is currently ranked number 6 in UFC light heavyweight division and he is touted to be one of the most complete fighter in light heavyweight who will challenge for UFC title some point in 2022 or 3. But it wasn't that he was taking the time off. He was actually booked against Alexander Gustafsson in September. But Gustafsson pulled out of that fight due to an disclosed injury. Then he accepted a fight against number 9 ranked light heavyweight contender Nikita Krylov. He was going to fight him on December 12th card but it wasn't to be because he was Paul Craig was not able to enter United States because of the double vaccination rule. He said that I was not able to get my double vaccination on time so it was not possible for me to make that fight on December 12th. But he said that that fight is still not fall off and he will fight Nikta Krylov some point in January or February. He said that he would like to fight him in March because UFC might organize a UFC London card in London. So that would be a great opportunity and he is looking forward to that because it has been a long time since he has fought in the front of UK fans. He is predominantly used as a gatekeeper by UFC but he still has that burning desire to challenge for UFC title one day and he wants to make a run for it and it will be good for him as well because if he fights Nikta Krylov and if he wins that fight then he will be ranked in top 10 and UFC light heavyweight, heavyweight division is on move right now. There are a lot of matchup booked. Jan Blohovic is going to fight Anthony Smith. Magomed Ankalaev is fighting Thiago Santos. So he will have plenty of opportunity in 2022 to move upwards in the ranking. Let's hope things work out best for him and thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel.